Residents and traders in the Pengkalan Kubo duty-free zone objected to the Tumpat District Council's plan to implement paid parking in the area from April 1st. Pengkalan Kubo duty-free zone traders association chairman Halim Hussein said they were disappointed with the council, which only thought about profits without thinking about the fate of traders and residents. Ya, uh, PBT yang bertanggungjawab iaitu Majlis Daerah Tumpat. Uh, telah me mengeluarkan uh, uh, notis untuk uh, membuat sistem parking berbayar dalam zon berbacukan Pekalan Kubu dengan tanpa perbincangan uh, dengan kita sebagai peniaga pemain industri yang utama dalam zon berbacukan Pekalan Kubu dan juga tanpa perbincangan dengan tuan-tuan uh, uh, tanah Met after holding a rally at his residence in Tumpat, Halim said part of the land in the duty-free zone is privately owned, involving 100 traders and five houses, while only 50 traders are under the state government. Commenting further, Halim said he had met with a local authority after receiving information about the implementation through Facebook on February 27th. He said the local authority informed everyone that they would also be charged as there are no privileges for traders or residents. More than 200 ringgit per month will be charged to traders with an estimated nine ringgit per day if paid parking is implemented. Meanwhile, a resident said the local authority's action did not make sense as she had lived in the house for decades since she was born there.